Hey guys, it's uh, Quarter Pound here over in uh, Lothar US server, uh, better known as QP. Um, it's uh, here, I'm here in Orgrimmar. Uh, it's after the 4.0 patch, it's October 30th. Uh, I just wanted to make a quick instructional video on how to get on top of Orgrimmar as a priest. Um, <clears throat> there's been a lot of speculation that you can't do it anymore and that you need GM buffs and all kinds of other things I've heard. Um, so I figured I'd give it a try myself, um, and see if I actually still could do it as a priest. Uh, I've heard, you know, they've changed the way the mountains were scaled, all, all kinds of things. So I just wanted to make a quick uh, up-to-date video on how to do it with a priest. Um, basically, uh, I have my priest here. I'm going to run him out here through the barrens and to Duratar. <clears throat> and we're just going to have to uh, hop out here over the uh, river. It's a fairly short travel from Orgamar. Uh, just gonna hop through here. We're just gonna cut a right up uh, through here, um, through the uh, mine. I've heard you can do this with other classes, um, you know, that don't have slow fall or things of that nature. Levitate. Um, there is a way. I think you can walk along the side of the mountain and still hop up on top. Um, I haven't tried it yet. Uh, it's just easier with the priest. Um, I think a mage can do it as well uh, with the slow fall ability. Uh, I know anybody with rocket boots and parachutes, uh, things like that, you can most likely if you can get there to the top, you can do it. So now that you've cut around the back of that uh, building here, and I have a venture in <laughs> force for slamming my headless horseman's mount, um, wherever the tree is here, you want to take this mountain up here. Um, Hop up here. Zoom out a little bit. <laughs> this guy's still following me. Yeah, there he goes. Ah, damn it. Okay. Anyway, so I want to run up the mountain here. Wow. Slipping and sliding. The mountains seem a little weird today. Alright. Once you get up to about here, you just want to hop down the side of this plateau here. You're just going to skip over to the other side here. Continue on up your travels to the top. Once you get up to this part right here, it's going to want to swing on top, right up to the top there. Get to the highest point that you can here. You're going to want the height for when you get to the end. So you're going to want to hit levitate right out there. And just stick to the side of the wall and wall walk. So you're going to take this around. Stay tight to the wall. Continue wall walking. Got to kind of be a little quick, but be cautious, just because Levity does have a two-minute timer, and if you get a little tricky there, um, you don't want to find yourself all of a sudden dropping off the side of the mountain. Uh, that would be a little annoying for anybody. So anyway, just kind of keep sidestepping the wall here. And uh, doo -doo -doo. the mountain, oh, can't see through the tree. Okay, there we go. Now we are on top of the mountain. So basically, this is where you have two choices, I've come to realize. Um, let me just get up here so you can see. Okay. Now basically, you can jump from here and land on the uh, pedestal there on the bottom of this tower. Or you can do what I like to do and go up to this one and uh, land directly on the top of that tower. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to show you how to do that. So basically, let's just hop on over there so we can mount up to go over there. Like I said, highest point, hit levitate, stay tight to your wall, cut around the right side of this mountain here, and you're going to see the slope, and you can just kind of run up the side there. Done. Right up on the top. Okay. As you can see, it's a shower over there, and at this point, it's pretty obvious, you're just going to mount up, aim, and fire. That's it. Smooth sailing.
right on the top. Mount up. Check out your new surroundings. Um, I'm pretty sure you can jump and land over there if you so chose, because you can actually land if you look. The uh, thing runs right into the mountainside. So you can actually hop right from here, get on this side if you chose to, um, which basically is only going to run you along here. Uh, if you can see, it doesn't glitch out too bad, but you're really running to the front gate because this is the main center of the bar. So basically, you're just going to hop down. Down about 12k, 13k. Heal up. And that's it, my friends. You are in Orgamar. On top, that is. And that's it. You're free to roam as you please. <laughs> you can explore, check out what's going on. It's a little glitchy up here. I will warn you if you do step over this boundary, you will fall into what I like to call the Brown Barrens Deep of Orgamar. It's not nice down there. You will die. It's a very far drop. Uh, there you go. You can see what it looks like there. That's what they call underneath Orgrimmar. Um, you can get it from under there also. Uh, I could show you in another video. You just gotta hop up on the front gate and you can basically just... You can literally wall walk this entire place. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> I can show you that in a different vid. And, um, like I said, you know, you're just free to roam up here. Um, there is a way that you can hop to the other side once you come around here and get up on top of the uh, Flight Master Tower. I'm probably going to show you that in a different video. Um, this one, like I said, I just really wanted to show you how to get up here in general um, after the 4.0 patch. Alright, if you have any questions or feedback, just leave it on the uh, comment section below. Thanks for watching.